Three quarters have been played, but the outcome remains undecided. Welcome, everyone, to the start of the fourth quarter. Here's Fisher. To Fisher. Here's Bryant. Plays like that tell you who's hungry. And here are the Bucks now, trailing by four. Selman. And the rebound goes to Paul Gasol. I think he's really starting to lose confidence in his shot. Those misses are getting to him. Here's Selman. Oh! Here's Fisher. And the turnover by the Lakers. You got to watch your step there along the baseline. Coaches don't like those unforced turnovers. And here are the Bucks now. A two-point game. Here's Bogut. I'm inside. Gasol with the rebound. You gotta expect more out of him here. He's had a lot of difficulty this quarter, which in turn is making it difficult for them to cut into this deficit at all. Here's Fisher. On the paint, graceful finish. Sweet touch by the ninth year veteran out of Spain. Red. Off the mark with the three ball. He can't fault that shot since he was wide open, but he may have rushed it just a little bit. Here's Bryant. Connects from in close. They're in front, 54 to 48. So it's Milwaukee. Here's Kogut. Easy shot, cannot hit. And it's the Lakers taking it the other way. The Lakers call timeout here and take their last 20-second timeout. They're winning by six. 2.57 left in the fourth. Cheryl Miller has something for us from a conversation with Scott Skyler. Cheryl? Thanks, Kev. He told his team that he wants them taking more shots from beyond the arc. He said, if you got a good look, fire it up. Don't be tentative. He's giving them the green light, guy. All right, thanks, Cheryl. And Brian gets it to go. Kevin, they're fighting extremely hard right here. Bit by bit, just trying to pull away. And here are the Bucks. Trailing here by eight. Jennings, kept alive. Here's Jennings. Here's Salmons. The three won't fall. Kevin, they've got the edge here in rebounding. They're doing a good job of blocking out and then pursuing the basketball. That's good fundamental action. And it's Bryant missing. The Bucks trail. He's got to push it. The handoff to Bogut, covered by Artest. Goes up, tips. Great play by Artest. The Lakers in the lead. Fisher on the elbow. Bryant. The air ball sailed out of bounds by Bryant. He's really been terrific all game long. It seems like every missed shot is ending up in his hand. Is rebounding something you can work on, Clark, or, or is it just natural ability? I think it's a combination. You can work on rebounding, but the very best rebounders do it naturally. They've got tremendous timing, excellent strength, and they're also very good second jumpers. They get off their feet quick, and then they've got a desire to pursue the ball.
Salmons. Onstras, top of the key. Here's Jennings. Can't put an end to this scoring drive. The defense has really done a nice job. So ran wrap tight, making it very hard for him to get great looks at the basket here in the fourth quarter. On defense for Lakers. Eight-point game. Here is Mbamute. Nails it from close range. And they cut it to six. Well, it's almost impossible to miss when the D is playing that song. Here's Fisher. Shoots. When you settle for that kind of shot, that's a wasted possession. That is not a high percentage look. Less than one minute left. Selman kisses it off the glass and in. Effortless, soft layup. Nice play. Here's Fisher. From short range. And Clay gets it to go. So far. Here's Red. Buries the runner. Here's Fisher. The Bucks are intentionally fouled. Here's Fisher. They lead by four. One second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Here's our test. Great D. In the best of circumstances, that's going to be a tough shot for him. And that was not the best of circumstances. And it's Milwaukee's ball. Four-point game. Selma drops it in on the layup. Oh, that clutch is the clutch. They needed that one, Cass. The Lakers call time, and they've got one left. They're in front by two. 13 seconds left to the fourth. Over here, over here. Here's Fisher. The Bucks commit the intentional foul, and they'll try to extend the game. That's the right move. Stop the clock. I hope they make a mistake you can take advantage of. Good on the first, and that makes it a three-point lead. Perfect from the line, and it's a four-point ball game. And that'll do it, Kevin. Those last three throws were the icing on the cake. Here's Red, and Andrew Bynum pulls it down. The Lakers. Win the hard-fought game as they outlast the Bucks, 60 to 56. For his solid performance, Kobe Bryant is our Jordan Brand Player of the Game. Yeah, Kevin, he was really stroking. He shot the lights out, and there was just no one out on the floor who could stop him. Well, that's it for us. On behalf of Clark Kellogg, Cheryl Miller, and me, Kevin Harlan, thanks for tuning in to NBA Basketball on 2K Sports.